General Fraser, we wish you and Bev and your family all the best as you conclude nearly four action packs four decades of service to your country, distinguished service to your country. Everyone here today knows that together you delivered. But yet, while in some ways it's sad to leave, I know that I'm leaving you in exceptionally good hands. With Paul and Ricky Selva coming in, I know that you'll continue to excel. And I can think of no one that's more qualified and ready to take the helm and take this command to the next level. We are still the most respected military in the world. I know that whatever challenges are out there, that we will have the right leaders at the right place to make the right decisions. Within each challenge, I say there is an opportunity. There is an opportunity to make things better. So whether to, so whether to all of you here, whether you are military, civilian, contractor, or commercial teammate, I applaud your positive can-do attitude and your innovation. You are all true professionals, and I challenge you, as I did back in 2011, to continue to lead. So now it's time for this Aggie to giddy up. Move on down the trail. So may God continue to bless each and every one of you and our entire United States military in the United States of America. God bless each and every one of you. Thank you.